My name is Tyler Kellen. I'm 32 and I'm from Arlington, Vermont. Hi, my name is Tara. I am 32 years old and I live in Arlington, Vermont. So I have this really vivid memory uh, when I was a, a little kid of riding in the back of our station wagon like it was a backseat facing station wagon and seeing this like parachute with a fan on it like flying over our cornfield and I always thought to myself like I want to do that someday. It seemed really cool and I'd mostly forgotten about it for multiple decades and earlier this year my wife Tara and I were thinking about uh, going on some kind of new adventure and uh, that memory came back to me and I described it to Tara and she was like well that sounds really cool but neither of us had any idea what it actually was so uh, we did some googling and so we found out that it was called um, powered paragliding and we started looking at uh, dealers and companies and wound up talking with a guy named Rob at Black Hawk uh, Paramotors out of California and we had a really great conversation and pretty much sold us immediately on coming out here to do it. So pretty. So we got here this morning and there was like a guy taking off and a guy getting towed and like people in the air. It's amazing. Just watching people flying from this close, it's incredible. Also it looks looks pretty easy. I don't know, I'm excited. I was really sold by the low and slow, at least for me, like safety is my number one concern. So I wanted to go with some place that was serious, it seemed like they knew their stuff and they had their shit together. Um, so yeah, that's why I picked Blackhawk. When we called, somebody answered and immediately knew, you know, basically the answer to every question that we asked. Um, everybody seemed really knowledgeable and excited about us coming out to do this. One of the many things that sold us on Blackhawk. So the Blackhawk Ranch is gorgeous. Just rolling hills and open plains and, and this is a different kind of beauty altogether. There's huge open sky. Yeah, I kind of feel like I'm in a western. The Blackhawk Ranch is in the middle of nowhere and beautiful and huge. And uh, they're off grid. My wife and I are also off grid, which I think is awesome. And um, yeah, the place is great. Hey, I'm Joe. Hi, Joe. Nice, <laughs> nice to, meet to meet you. you. So I got your uh, syllabus here with your waiver. Just got to okay. Have you sign all that you completed? Okay. All right. Perfect. Thank Thanks. you. I love the idea of Tyler and I just sort of tootling around in the air together. Getting there is going to be an interesting adventure. I'm just excited to get in the air. I think it looks amazing. All right, we're going to do this thing. There you go. Uh, Joe is a fabulous instructor um, and just a really sweet guy. I think that's what I really like about him. I have been nervous for most of this course, and he's just so calming. So anytime we hook into the glider, we're gonna always wear a helmet, okay? And always be prepared to handle that wing. You know, really understanding where I'm at and not pushing me to go too far, but encouraging me each step of the way. So that feels really good. There you go. You just wanna pull it just a little bit to where you can see it kind of tugging and against like, the glider. And grab the middle one here. Yep. Mm -hmm. So we've been training with Joe Cruz, uh, one of the Black Hawk instructors, and he's totally fantastic. Every question we have, he's got a good answer for. Every problem we have, he's got some great advice. I feel really, really comfortable that he has our safety in mind, and um, yeah, it's just been great. So we're in the uh, Black Hawk shop here, just uh, learning how to put together one of the uh, 125s. It's pretty cool. Yeah. It's gorgeous. It's a thing of beauty. It's totally badass. Yeah.
So I think safety is really important at Black Hawk. It's super important to my wife, Tara. We want to slow that wing down, all right? So that wing will fall back and you swing back under. Normally I'm pretty cavalier about safety when it comes to like adventure sports, but I'm taking it really seriously here because uh, flying is a serious thing. Well, let's go ahead and start doing some simulators first to see how you respond to situations like this. Um, so yeah, I think uh, I think the guys are, are really concerned for our safety. They're not pushing us to do anything that we don't know how to do or aren't comfortable with. So everybody sort of moves at their own pace. It's pretty great. So it's day three and it's pretty exhausting so far. We're out on the field uh, kiting, getting ready for the uh, winds to die down for the night flight, hopefully. Definitely can tell that I'm getting better, so that's good. I'm feeling pretty comfortable kiting now. Pull up right the back, and make a turn, and then run. Get the under it. Good. So after we learned how to kite the wings, uh, we moved on to towing, which is like the next step before you actually do a foot launch. We are going to do some toes. With a winch and they you know pull it up to you and hook it into your harness um, and that just like pulls you up into the air. Towing is awesome. Towing is really fun. I was nervous, of course, but I did it and it's so much fun. I'm gonna do some kiting with the motor. Uh, just run down the field and maybe hopefully Joe will say full throttle and go flying. That was pretty fucking awesome. <laughs> How was that, man? Your first flight. Talk to me about it. I don't know. It was amazing. It's so cool to be up in the air on your, under your own power. Like, holy hell. Good job. Thanks. It's the coolest thing I've ever done, like, easily. Like, holy hell. It's so fun. You could see, like, out a million miles. I don't know, a million miles, but really far. It's really cool. As soon as your feet leave the ground, everything gets easy. Like, once you're in the air, you just grab a bunch of throttle and you're going up, and the vistas expanding out before you are incredible. It's just such a cool, freeing feeling. I don't know what, exactly what I expected, but it was way better than anything that I expected. <laughs> 